Hello and welcome to Sonoran Scale Studios. In today's video, taking a Axial SCX24, this is a deadbolt, removing the frame rails and body and replacing it with a 3D printed EL style chassis and cage. Previously, I had put together a couple videos that were featuring what I called the RR24. And it, that was an Axial SCX24. I believe that that one started out as the C10 and was converted over with a 3D printed RR10 bomber scaled down version. It was really, really cool. And this one is really no different. Equally as cool in its own separate individual ways. And if you're not already in the know on 3d printing which i fall into that category i am not in the up and up with 3d printing really it's kind of a foreign uh, concept to me and i'm aware of its existence but i know very little about the process itself but what i do know is that the results that people that know what they're doing can get incredible and it changes this hobby in a big big way if you are in this hobby new to the hobby and for example you've got an axial scx24 and you want to change the look you don't want to buy a whole new truck but you want a whole new look right so you go on google you go on whatever search engine and you punch in scx24 body you're gonna get a handful of results and they're likely gonna be nothing that you want they're gonna be stock variants things like that and and really the options are limited relatively speaking compared to the options that are available through 3d printing again I'm no expert on it as a matter of fact I wouldn't even consider myself a novice I'm just aware of the fact that it exists so if you are like me I would say start looking into this and start looking for somebody that already knows how to 3D print, that produces this stuff, that either sells it or could help you out. I will put links in the description down below where I got this one and a link to his Instagram and one of his eBay pages because this really does just blow the roof off your options in this hobby it's like 3d printing was made for this scale hobby and people's creativity continues to blow my mind so if you're not already familiar with it i'm glad that you were here for this video because the light has been shed on it now start googling it and we will see you in the next one